Hi everyone, today I'm going to talk about my track Fight or Flight. It's a track I made back in medical school when I first heard a heartbeat with my stethoscope. The diaphragm of the stethoscope is very similar to the, to the diaphragm of my microphone. I thought it would be really cool to be able to record my own heartbeat and use it in one of my own uh, musical compositions. That's where it started. So the track's actually in three sections and it's about the effect of adrenaline on the heart and how stress can be a good thing and a bad thing. So I wanted people to feel the pulsation of my heartbeat in this track. The first section is quite simple. It's the anxious phase of stress and you start feeling this uneasiness. So I wanted the visualization of this to be like you're on a red blood cell inside the heart and you're experiencing what the human being is, is experiencing from inside. So that's the first section. And then it kind of moves into a bit more dramatic. The, 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 there's a bit of a somber moment. And then the final section is that positive effect of stress on the heart where you're in that knockout punch round and you need that extra push to get to the finishing line. So let's start with how I recorded the heartbeat. So the track starts quite literally with my heartbeat. So I took a microphone and put it to the apex of my heart there. And you can see here there's a bit of information coming through. So let's hit record. See what that shows. Okay, so you can see that. You can see the level there, it's coming through. Stick a bit of gain on it. There's a lot of background noise there. Let's put a noise gate. I took it just to where it's opening the gate. And then you stick a bit of distortion on it. So you can start to hear it coming out and then just EQ that up. Take the low end out. the guitar amp. Let's try uh, So that's basically how I got it and ended up having to clean it up a bit, added a bit of pitch correction and this is what it sounded like. You can see that when I recorded this back in medical school, my heartbeat, I must have been a lot more relaxed. So my heartbeat was a lot lower. It was around 70 BPM. I then added a bunch of effects to it. So I'm quite happy with that. Next, we've got the kick drum, which runs alongside the heartbeat and acts as the side chain compression as well for the track. Uh, this is what it sounded like uh, originally, just a normal, kick sample that I played on the keys and then I added a filter to it I'm a big fan of the one knob filter and then added a bit of sausage fattener secret ingredient sounds pretty cool so then with the heartbeat that's the combined sound next moved on to the guitar so this is what we've got with the guitar these are some chords Originally I wanted it to sound like it was on a flamenco guitar, building up in emotion. And, but I decided to use an electric guitar because you can still get a level of emotion and it, and it served the purpose of the track quite nicely. So yeah, this is a, the chord progression that lasts throughout the track. Um, and this is what it sounded like in the end. With everything else. Then I added a bit of lead guitar. And this is what it sounded like. Um, 
Element plugin from Output. It's a really cool plugin. You can you can really add some cool um, effects and literally adds movement, which is what what I wanted to have in this starting bit. bass so that's the first section I just had a, a brass synth that comes into it so this is what that sounds like to the next section um, so we've got this drum beat sample so the drum beat is um, automated so you can see here filtered and then we've got these it's like a vocal synthesizer um, from output called exhale this is the sound of that one. It's quite sinister sounding, but I really wanted it to feel like you were inside a body. So with everything in the mix. section um, things start to get a bit more dramatic so I did a bit of strings you're on this red blood cell going through the heart I wanted there to be some drama and emotion um, and get the adrenaline pumping so that's just the cello sound uh, just loop that up. this is the cello sound This is the violin. Two violins. And that with, with the mix. So the last section of the track is where stress is a good thing. You need that adrenaline rush to get that knockout punch and get you over that finish line. So this, it just, it's basically components from the other sections with the guitar solo. For the guitar solo, I use the movement plugin to add movement. And that's pretty much it. I hope that gave you some of an insight into how I made the track and what it's all about. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure you check out Fight or Flight on Spotify and comment, like, share if you, if, if you think this video was useful. Uh, the experimental EP is going to be released, so make sure you follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook. All the social media links are down below, and you can stay updated with what I'm doing with music and the mental health project as well. So I'll see you next time. Stay tuned.